good morning. Monster Producers, Coach Burt. <clears throat> Hope you're doing great. It's Tuesday, and you know on Tuesday I like to bring you a little bit of a rhythm. And the rhythm is how to keep in a flow. How to, how to, how to get up, get going. And today's rhythm is a simple one. It's about, man, at level 10 opportunities go to people to get up, folks. Level 10 opportunities go to people who get moving. Level 10 opportunities. So people always ask me about the morning, morning routines. And I'm a big believer, Jamie, in feeding all parts of your nature by 8 a.m. in the morning. And I think that's a big activator of prey drive, right? Feed the body. Feed the mind. Good morning, Lori. Feed the heart. And feed the spirit, right? I believe level 10 opportunities go to people who don't operate in a slumber in life, but who who get up and go and, and, and move, right? So people ask me, what do you do? Well, this morning by 8 a.m., I'm already up, worked out, uh, taking a walk, making sales calls, banging on people, putting together deals, uh, following up. And that's a big piece of the equation, Tad Richardson, just, man, following up on opportunity. And I talked about this last night in my Legendary Creature Package, uh, when I was coaching folks, is that the follow-up, Lori Stye, is not just on consumers. See, a lot of people think the follow-up is just calling on people to try to sell them something. And I would tell you that level 10 opportunities are exactly that. They're big opportunities that have to be worked to their maturation. Meaning, I'm not always following up with people to try to close business. I'm following up with people on own new opportunity. I'm following up with people on strategic partnership. I'm following up with people on, uh, with people who said they were going to do something but haven't done it yet. I'm following up with people who I think could open the door. So for you, when you think about level 10 opportunity, once the day gets going, folks, it's it's hectic. It's crazy. It's things are coming at you. There's problems and 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 you're in the current of the urgent, which is why you got to get up and get rolling. And you got to take that tiger and tackle that tiger by the tail, all right? And you got to say, no, 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 no. There's big opportunity. So remember this. You hear me say it all the time. You don't need more money. You need more people. The people have the money. And what you got to do is remember a, a, a phrase. An object at rest will stay at rest unless acted on by an outside force. And that force has to be you. And it's not because people are lazy, although they are lazy. It's really because they're distracted, and you're trying to bring a deal to its fruition. You're trying to open a door. You're trying to create a movement. You're trying to, to get a person at the end of the day to, to move. That's really what you're trying to do. So the level 10 person gets up in the morning, has their hit list ready, has their farm club ready, has their strategic partnerships ready. The level 10 person is not operating around. Good morning, Brad Fowler, in a slumber and waiting on things to happen. The level 10 person wakes up. It's like, it's happening today. There's deals to close. There's partnerships to form. There's, there's new relationships to create. There's new money to go get. The level 10 person is not waiting on opportunity to happen. They are mm, pushing, pushing that opportunity, folks. That is the level 10 person. Is, is where there's not a way, they find a way. And where there's a will, my granddad taught me this. Where there's a will, there's always a way. Where there's a want to, there's always a how to, folks. So you got to make up your mind if you're going to go get your unfair share of the pie this morning. You got to make up your mind if you're going to bang and nudge and bump and invite. You're going to make up your mind. You got to make up your mind uh, if you're going to if you're going to go get it or you're going to sit back and wait on somebody else to get. Because somebody's going to get it today, folks. Somebody's going to get it, and that somebody's going to be either you or it's going to be somebody who's hungrier than you. When I was a basketball coach, I used to tell my team, uh, there's always somebody out there working harder than us right now, Cynthia. There's always somebody working harder than us. And that's who's going to win the championship today. It ain't going to be us because we are not working hard enough. There comes a time when winter asks what you did all spring and summer. And if you're going to be a monster producer, you got to suck it up, buttercups. You got to get up in the morning and you got to get rolling. Trust me, you'll feel better. You'll feel better when you put that first deal together. This morning, I've already been working on at least, let's see, $110,000, at least $100,000 $100, worth of business this morning before 8 a.m. So let's push. Let's go. That's before my morning meeting with the team. That's coming up next. So 
Level 10, guys. You guys are level 10 people, okay? I believe in you. God bless you. Let's go get it today. Dominique, it's out there. We just got to go get it, man. We just got to go get it. Let's go, folks.